we started on a new project. We got an E46 that we're going to convert to a drift car, mystery motor. Just check it out. We just dropped it off at Outfab. Probably get painted on Monday and back to our shop by midweek. And we have a lot of work to do. So once it's back at the shop, I think that we can put it together in maybe two months, maybe a little bit less. And then we'll send it to get the harness done. Once that's done, we're ready to roll. We have pretty much everything. I mean, we have engine mounts. Transmission is already set up for it. Brackets, whole interior seats are coming from Bridge Moto. It's gonna be eight weeks for those. Wheels we have, SLR kit, BC coilovers, obviously the dual caliper kit that we're selling. So yeah, two months we'll have it wrapped up. Man, nice to meet you, bro. Yeah, it's <laughs> Here we are. Fancy stuff. I good. like it, man. Hey, I don't know how this guy ain't crashed yet, but I want to learn how to drive from him, man. Right. <laughs> so we are transforming those into this color. Okay, sounds good, man. And we just what drove in. We're like, holy shit, this thing is like twice the amount now. Yeah, yeah, man. Yeah. But I mean, it just don't stop, bro. You see what's just non-stop and all the Who's time, doing man. the small stuff, bro? Well, I got, you know, I got another paint in here for a second shift.
taking the new build home. After a long time, what, three months waiting now? Obviously, it's not going to sell much more, but we're going to make it happen, make it look good. Put that in 54 and then see how it fares well. You know? Like this, yeah, right? No, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> so, what's going on, guys? The car is finally back here again, and we have a lot of work to do. Pretty much this week, we're gonna start putting the complete suspension back on and make it a roller so that next week we can bring the N54 here, put it on a stand, put all these goodies on it, show the goods, all the goods on it and begin pretty much assembling the car. The harness is done, so as soon as that comes in, we're gonna plug it in and see if, we, if we're missing anything else, and then he's gonna drive over to this coast, finalize all the little ins and outs of it, and wire the AEM, put everything else that we need to put in the car. Then we shall begin on the interior at least then we'll be able to move the car in and out obviously the shop is not big enough and we still need to work on the green cars as they come along so this is going to be a much simpler version of my car this is a sponsored car Poseidon Industries sponsored this car pretty much it is a competition car it's going to be to everything pro-am spec it's not gonna get a lot of the tubing work that the other car did but it's still gonna be a very reliable clean standalone harness nothing too crazy but it's gonna be fast it's definitely gonna gonna push over 600 horsepower and it's gonna be fun it's gonna be a, a lot easier to drive than the other car because i'm using a 5862 precision turbo instead of the big Borg warning that I have on the other cars so I'll be pretty much more competitive with the lower horsepower cars and the inspiration of this car is that beauty up there which is the Lime Rock E92 M3 which is the same color that we went with that goes well not only with this car but it goes well with the Poseidon colors it's gonna get a full livery it's gonna be pretty much a competition slash drive as much as I can so I can get comfortable I chose the E46 because I'm definitely know this chassis inside and out so we're gonna start by welding the back subframe on these cars as a piece of uh, 
garbage weld those plates in put the rear subframe in front is pretty much all done as you can see in there we can start putting brakes on set the wheels set the wheels on the back drop the car then we could do whatever we need to do to it but that pretty much wraps up this week next week we'll be putting in the engine and doing a lot of things to it to make sure it fits if it does fit and everything is good we'll be selling the mounts so that you guys can purchase and do your own swaps that wraps it up subscribe to see this beauty started in a few weeks yeah.